This is the Jagasit Podcast. Make me he, feel like a man. Yeah, but he doesn't want to have sex with him. He wants Hot. to fight him, and they do. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I, 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 that, that's how that's how fucking like bisexual, pansexual I am because yeah. like. Uh, I, I somehow I just got this thought of these two guys. I'm like, sorry, I got I Kratos got... and Boulder having hot stink. Lindsay. Oh shit! <laughs> Lindsay. Sorry. You just went off into a different. <laughs> wow. Anyway, so Freya's son, his deal is she covered. She she did a spell on him that made him immortal. The problem is the side effect of this spell is that it took away his ability to feel anything. Essentially she did a spell to keep her child from being hurt which is something a re- a mother would want to do but it's not a really reasonable thing to do but the problem is by taking away her son's ability to feel she created a sociopath. Yes. Boulder was basically the first sociopath. And Boulder became obsessed with murdering with matricide. He wanted to kill his own mom for her taking away his ability to feel and he Pretty much, I like, had to. he abuses Kratos and Atreus the whole time. And literally, a K- dick. Kratos and Atreus are just like, we literally just want to dump some ashes off of a mountain. Like, we, we don't just, know what the fuck your problem is. We just to get rid of the rain- remains of Atreus's mom. Yeah, like, my mom just died. I'm just trying to dump her ashes off I'm not off looking of to mountain. help you kill your mom. Really I really not trying to, your problem is. Yeah, really not trying to get into a fight with you right now. But, you know, Boulder's not hearing it. He's, He's kidnapping him. He's riding dragons. Punching people in the face, <laughs> dragging them into the icy depths of hell, hallucinating in, in, in his mom's Helheim reflection in, in Helheim. You know, he is all tripping over balls the place. in Helheim. Yeah, he had the tripping balls in Helheim. He is all okay, over. Okay, so now you need to explain the whole Freya and Atreus thing because that has like literally well, been the biggest part. Well, this is this is the part that Lindsay and I don't agree on. At the end of the game, <sighs> here's, here's the deal. At the end of the game, uh, Boulder tries to kill Freya. And Freya, as a mother, is going to let Balder murder her. Kratos, who had already spared Balder's life to not kill him just for the sake of killing him, decides to then kill him to protect Freya. Because at that point, Balder was so corrupt in the mind, there was no way that he was going to want anything else but to kill his own mother. And Kratos said, ironically, which is a really dark thing, Kratos said, the, he, he repeated his father Zeus's last words, which is the cycle must end here. Wait, Zeus's last words weren't, I want to go fuck that mortal girl disguised as a swan? That was his second to last words. Okay. <laughs> his last word, one of his last words was the cycle must end here, or the cycle ends here, something of that degree. Okay. But basically, Kratos was trying to say that the cycle of of fathers, of, of, of uh, demigod fathers being murdered by their sons, or parents being murdered by their children in the god world, needs to end. And the only right. way that'll end is Kratos ends his life okay but mainly he did it to save freya's life because she helped him and atreus out on their journey she's a good person like she was a good you know goddess and my thing is that well after that uh, uh, freya claimed revenge on kratos and atreus and i thought that was a, a dick move here's the thing it's not that i agree with her reaction to them i understand like if i were freya I understand their reaction and I wouldn't be mad at them. However, I do think I, I do understand why she was prepared to let her child kill her. And I can explain why the reason I understand that is because a, a mother's instinct is to protect her child. And if it means sacrificing yourself, that's obviously going to be the first thing that makes sense. And second of all, she felt like she owed him her life. She, she took a part of his life. She, she ruined his by trying to protect him. And if I were a mother and I did that to my child, I would probably be like, okay, kill me. I fucking did you really wrong by accident because I was trying to do right by you. Well, here's the crazy thing. Kratos had the exact same thought. And after he parents instinct. Yeah. After he after he killed Balder and, you know, to defend Freya and Freya claimed revenge on he and Atreus. Atreus asked him. Why did she react? Like, he questioned the situation, and the exact same thing uh, that, that Lindsay just said, Kratos said. That's not the part I had the issue with. That's right. It's the fact that on the back end of all of that very relevant reasoning, this chick doubled down on her bullshit and decided that it was okay for her to see them as the enemy when literally a good chunk of the Nine Realms is destroyed and messed up because of a decision she made about her now, son. I mean, he literally punched Jormungandr, the world's... You can find the Jugaset podcast on YouTube and Spotify every Monday and Friday. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and follow at Jugaset Podcast on all social media.